seafood um, mix. It's actually my own recipe but it might be similar to other uh, recipes that you can you can see in the internet or somewhere else but then this is what I do um, um, in my own recipe. So there. So let me show you what are the things that I'm going to use. First we have the sugar here. Never mind my rice cooker because there's no place that I can place it. So, we also have scallions. These are actually for aesthetic use, but then it also gives an aroma to the, to the dish. Of course, my toasted sesame seeds. And then, please, never mind the container. It's actually Dengjang container, but actually, it's Siling Labuyo or our very own um, chili. Chili Labuyo, there. And then the tashida, black pepper, of course, the chili powder. We have onions. We have crushed garlic. And we have the butter. And then, of course, we have also the salt. And then this is something that I will really recommend you guys. This is from Thailand. Um, I don't know exactly how to how to pronounce it but it's Pantanoi Rasing brand it's a mild chili sauce but then um, there's another one although naubusan na ako uh, the, the, there's hot and spicy one which is really really good for our seafood because I want it's really spicy and then we have soy sauce and then sesame oil there there are the essential ingredients now what are the things that i'm going to cook for now so we have here crabs the crabs were like how many pieces three, three pieces of crabs and then we just cut it into into twos and then we just try to remove the other parts of it so that it will not be so bulky then we have also the tahong the clams and it's already opened and we have here one one piece of medium size lumot or squid and then we have here eight pieces of large shrimps and then dory fish so there you have it and then of course we have the oil to to fry it to fry it first and then we're going to boil some 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 of the seafoods while it's uh, I'm gonna boil and fry it our pan of course we have to use the oil and I forgot that I will put um, water also together with the soy sauce so it won't be so very, very salty. So now it's a little bit hot. So we're going to put one fourth cup of oil. And then we just have to spread it all over. Then, while heating up, we are going to put some butter. I will be using 
um, this much of the butter. And then I will use also the same later. So, this is together with the oil. Now, I'm going to put lots of garlic. So, I'm going to put 4 tablespoons of garlic. put some chili, chili labuyo, uh, one tablespoon. Medyo frozen siya. Nagpo-frozen ako lagi ng mga, mga ingredients so that I don't have a problem when I'm, when I'm about to cook something. There you go. And then, going to put water on it. So, one cup of water. Probably two cups. Yeah. Then, I'm gonna mix it with the soy sauce. For the soy sauce, you could probably have Sorry for the background. My husband is talking to my daughter. <laughs> then I'm going to put black pepper now. boil na siya. So, I'm going to put ashita. Inuin ko guys yung mga ano niya para mag ano siya, mag lumasa siya kaagad sa seafood. So, I'm going to put half tablespoon. There. And now, we're going to put the seafoods one by one. Ah, oh, wait up. I forgot to put chili powder. So for the chili powder, I really want it to be quite spicy. So I'm going to put two spoonfuls of chili powder. Probably two and a half. Uh, super spicy siya talaga. So 
Tapos nga. And then, now, I'm going to start putting the seafoods. So, I will start with the squid. There. Madami akong stock nito because I just bought it um, recently and it's so, so fresh. I got it from my friend who's selling the seafoods. Shout out to Miss Lisette Alvaro. And by the way, the person who requested this is um, Crystal Nicolas. So I hope you will try to cook this one for yourself. Then I'm gonna put the crabs. These crabs are actually from Bataan. My mom used to bring bring us crabs and lagi lang from frozen sa, sa ref ko. So whenever I want to make seafood, seafood dish, panay akong meron ganito. I have a lot of supply before ng crabs because my family is from Pataan where you get actually the imported or for export na mga supo, tiger prawns, prawns in different sizes, you name it. Then I'll just wait up, I'll just remove them. I'm going to put the tahong now. are coming already so yeah. I have visitors despite of this quarantine because nakakaawa sila they don't have food in their homes because they live alone okay. then I'm going to put the tiger prawns By the way, yung mga crabs ko, they're already cooked. So, you just have to wait until it's hot. And then, I have dory fish. <laughs> Sorry about it, but that's how we just talk back talk to our friends. Then I will just put it, I will just set aside. Although I'm going to sprinkle a little bit of salt. Just two pinch of salt. And then I'm going to put again the butter. And you just let it like that. It really has to. So for now, I will just close it for a while and wait for it to really boil. There, it's boiling hot already. Let's check it out. There you go. Just going to put this aside. Okay, 
Now, I'm going to put the mild chili sauce. Actually, I'm going to use one whole of this one. I'm just going to use the remaining on this one. Mo hot and spicy to, it's really delicious for me. Mas gusto namin na super spicy. But then, if you are not really a spicy person na talagang gusto ko kumain ng spicy, so you can adjust the taste. But kami, we really want it to be super spicy. Kaya nag-add ako ng, ng siling labuyo para super spicy siya. Let me just try it first, kumbang, if I needed to add something else, baka hindi masyado, okay? a little bit um, salty and then a little sweet. Okay. Mas masarap kung gano'n ako siya ng konti pang chili powder. Para mas masarap for them because they like it really, really spicy. sesame oil. This is just for the aroma, guys, and like what I've mentioned before. So I will put two tablespoons of sesame oil there. And again, we have to mix it up. But feeling ko, gusto ko nagyan ng wood. para dumapot siya ng konti. I'm gonna put some bulyot para dumapot. Sorry guys, mga one fourth cup to. scallions on top of it. And then sesame seeds. Gudguran lang natin siya all over para magpa siya maganda. And then I'm going to close it again for a couple of minutes. This is our spicy seafood meal and um, these are the side dishes that we have now that we're going to share so I have our visitor Mr. Kim and Mr. Jason my, my fan and then my two girls and then of course my very very handsome husband so we're gonna eat now guys thank you for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel bye cheers Mabuti! <laughs> oh,